Smash the cup smash. Oh, 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 wow, that's incredible. Hey everyone, hope you're having an amazing day at Smart Queens. We just arrived to Kushtia, which is one of the cultural capitals of Bangladesh. It's a mid-sized city, but it is so friendly and there is an like overabundance of amazing street food. We're on our way to go eat kalai roti with smashed eggplant and duck curry. When those spices and mustard oil hit your tongue, oh, it's a flavor overdose. But first, we need a special cup of tea to get started. So to begin this street food tour of Kushtia, we are, it's the evening now, and we are starting with a cup of tea, but one of the greatest special cups of tea. The process, how they make it, is gonna be amazing. We're here to drink. Yeah, the cha, motka cha. Motka cha, but tandoori cha. Yes, yes. Mokka, yeah. cha. Yeah. Mokka cha. We call it motka cha. Motka cha. Yes, uh, it's, a, it's a tandoori cha. Yes. Amazing. So he's just heating up those clay cups over uh, just a volcanic flame of fire being fanned. Wow. Red hot. Wow. Volcanic. The aroma of that steam coming from that just is literally, watch this. So he takes it until it's glowing red hot. He pours in the cha, the chai, the milk tea and it just bubbles volcanic heat. That aroma is just incredible. Oh, I see, he's building up the tea in that, that pan and it's gonna have that unbelievably smoky aroma from the clay. Yeah, this is cool. Yeah, this is, this is so cool. cool. So cool. Rasif. So once he finishes boiling our whole pot, uh, then it boils in that copper kettle and then he just pours it into fresh clay cups to serve you. So it's not hot in the cup, you can still pick it up. That's frothy, that's foamy, that's bubbly. That was on, it was like literally on fire. It came out of a volcano, an amazing process. And we gotta taste it right now. Oh. Oh wow. The smokiness. <laughs> yeah, that is so creamy, so milky, sweet, and that smoky, that smoky flavor yeah. from the, the clay on fire. Right. Wow. Mm. It's rich. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah, it's so good. It's so good. It's so good and served so hot. And the flavor of the clay really does make a difference. It really right. does. Right enhance the flavor of the tea and the milk. Right. And I think, I think it also really enhances the flavor of the milk. Milk, milk itself. Kind of like Yeah, and uh, maybe, maybe they, they include the cardamom flavor in it. Maybe a, a little, little bit of cardamom. cardamom. Maybe most probably. But that heat, that heat really does oh. kind of caramelize the milk to make it more fragrant, to bring out that natural sweetness of the milk itself. <laughs> so refreshing. <laughs> Kalai roti and this is the duck curry. Kalai roti? Yeah, kalai roti with duck curry. 
and duck curry. There are different types of bhorta. Duck, duck curry. Yeah. Oh, and he's gonna make some eggplant right now. Yeah. He's gonna make some eggplant. Oh, this is a must. Oh. oh, he puts it into the fire. Yeah. It's like he's fishing. Yeah. <laughs> we have come to an amazing street food stall to begin eating. He is making. Well, he has a duck curry simmering. He has all sorts of vortas, which are these hand-squeezed mixtures of vegetables and mustard oil and spices. And then he's making, one of the main things that he makes here is this type of roti, roti right? Yeah, it's, kalai, it's famous, it's, it's called kalai roti. Kalai roti. It's famous in a, a particular district of uh, Bangladesh, which is like Chapai Nabab Ganj. Oh. Uh, it's a tradition. From, in the north. Oh, the okay. North, okay. Yeah. North. From the north. It's mainly from the north. It's famous in the northern parts of our country. Oh, okay, okay. And so you eat that together with the duck curry, yeah. with the duck curry and with the different portas. Oh, eggplant is ready. Oh, nice fishing eggplant. <laughs> what a move. So the eggplant is ready into water. She's going to peel it. So they have most of the vortas already prepared at the front, but they have kindly agreed to make us a fresh one, I believe. So just roasted that eggplant and now she's just peeling back the black blistered skin. Oh yes, the smash, the cup smash. That eggplant smells incredible. You can smell how smoky, how charred it is. And she's just mashing it until it's uh, almost a paste of eggplant. Oh, so they take these different sauces and add it to your... Amazing. They add it to your eggplant. Oh, shallots. Mustard oil. So we're also going to taste all of the different vortas just on their own, the little, they're like more like sauces. This place is amazing. The aromas of those curries and the vorta and the the roti. What yeah. type of grain is this made from? Though? It's like uh, the dal we we add. Ah. Kalai, kalai dal. Kalai is a type of dal. Yes. Like yeah. so, it's so it's a dal, yes. it's a lentil. Yeah, it's lentil, a yes. lentil bread. Yeah, lentil, and yeah, they wow. mix it with uh, 
three different types of, of dough. Grains. And, right. and, and you can feel how, how solid it is. It is muscular. thick yeah, and it's, heavy. It's heavy. And not oily at all. It's just like a straight yeah. up, like a hard bread. You can tell it's going to be filling and hearty and warming. Taste it on its own first. Mm. Yeah, it's thick. Yeah. It's crunchy. It's like, I like it. It's not oily at all. Just no. like hearty and filling right. and starchy. Really good. You have to have it like with the, yeah, this one. Horta. The eggplant, which she yeah. just whipped up, roasted all those, the mustard oil, the spices, the chili in there. Oh, it's so creamy. It's so roasted. Oh, 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 oh. oh, wow, that's incredible. It just melts in your mouth. It's almost soupy. Yeah. The eggplant is just, like, it, that fire is so hot that it literally <laughs> just, like, melts in the fire. So as you just mash it up, right. it is so unbelievably smoky. And it's too spicy as well. It is spicy, <laughs> yeah. It's spicy. Yeah. The crunch of the onions in there, the coriander. That is addictive. It's just a smoky eggplant paste that just melts in your mouth. Mm. Wow. That's so tasty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So good. But then additionally, we got all of the different bortas and then two different curries, the duck curry and the quail curry. Yeah. And I love this bread too. It's it rather than being like a fried bread, it's more like a roasted fire bread. All right. Mm. Yeah, that's, you can taste the onions, yeah. the sweetness, the sauce, the spices, the oiliness, Wonderful. it's incredible. So you can mix the eggplant with the duck. Oh, okay, the quail? Yeah, let's go. Looks like a similar curry, a similar sauce, just yes. with a quail. Go for the leg one. Oh. <laughs> Quail leg. Quail leg, the onions in there, the entire drumstick. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Oh. 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 <laughs> this one is even more better. Yeah, this one. That might be tastier than the duck. Yeah. That, and maybe, maybe it's because it was, the duck was freshly made. This one has been like, the flavors have been condensing. Yeah. yeah, right, right. Probably throughout the day. It tastes like more rich and more spices, actually. Yeah. Oh, man. The flavor is awesome. Just everything combined. Combined. Spicy, rich. Goes so well together with that smoky roti. The mustard, she topped everything with onions yeah. and then sprinkled on, drizzled on a little mustard oil. I gotta go mustard on mustard. <laughs> just straight up freshly ground mustard seed and it literally like is almost has a wasabi, wasabi taste to it right. kind of goes up your nose a little bit the freshness of it the pungency of that mustard seed is incredible oh i love it and then on top of that with mustard oil they even bring out the fragrance even more <laughs> I want to try this spicy one. I think that's just like straight up chili. Oh. <laughs> oh man, that's straight up ground red chili is spicy. Oh, that is flavor. Mm. Oh, the eggplant. Unbelievable. That flavor, that smokiness, that mustard oil. Mm. Mm. Yeah, that quail is outstanding. Sauces are just unbelievable. The mustard, the chili, 
the fresh ginger garlic, the coriander. And what a meal. This is my kind of food. I love everything that you can, you can see everything being prepared in front of you. And the flavor overdose is just out of control. What a place, what a meal, and we are moving on from here to eat a lot more street food. <laughs> Come on, join us. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> You're going to want to keep on watching because next up, we're on our way to go eat Chatputi and Fuchka, two of the greatest street foods in Bangladesh. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs>